Entering tonight, the San Elizario boys soccer team had never lost a match at the state tournament. Three trips to Georgetown, six victories and three class 4 a state championships in 2015, 2018 and 2019 for the Eagles. San Eli was back in the UIL soccer Mecca tonight. Two wins from another championship trying to advance back to the 4A state title game. Standing in their way, Hidalgo Early College Academy, a team with one state title to its name back in 09. A slow start for both teams, only two shots from each squad in the first half. It was scoreless at the break. Let's go second half, 20 minutes to go. San Eli with the free kick opportunity. Eduardo Martinez takes it, but misses high. Let's go 47 seconds left in the match now. A set piece for Hidalgo off of Steven Chavez's hands and somehow Reynaldo Cantu will score off the loose ball. Hidalgo wins it one to nil. A heartbreaking ending to San Elizario's season. Maybe the most heartbreaking finish you could possibly have as they went and two wins shy of a fourth state title. KTSM 9 Sports is the only local media entity on the road at the state tournament in Georgetown. Sam Guzman continues our coverage tonight, wrapping up a devastating San Eli loss. San Elizario's loss to Hidalgo tonight came in heartbreaking fashion. The moment that will haunt the Eagles on the way back home came off of a set piece about 30 yards out from goal and with 47 seconds left in the game. You know, I think he pushed that one. He was a little surprised that it hit the bar, but you saw him come straight back up. And that number nine is just a tank. He came straight through it. It was unfortunate to, to see us give that last second goal because I felt like we were really arriving at their goal. Uh, but that's soccer, you know. Now, this wasn't the way San Eli envisioned its season coming to an end, but they still held their heads high, being proud of what they've done and what's ahead. It didn't go our way, but um, I know that we gave it our all and we're not going home um, regretting anything like, oh, we could have done this better. Or we should have done this. We gave it all we had and it just it didn't go our way. But I'm happy that we, we fought till the end. This is not failure. This is short of perfection, but it is definitely not failure. It's a great team, very proud of this team. And I'm also very, very proud of the passion that they're showing after this game. It tells me a lot about what I have coming back. It tells me a lot about what I have to work with. So San Elizario finishes its season with 24 wins and as class 4A state semifinalist, you can bet the Eagles will be looking to get back to this point of the year and one game further in 2024. For now, reporting from Georgetown, Texas, Sam Guzman, KTS 9 Sports. Thank you, Sam. His stay in Georgetown continues tomorrow as the Bel Air boys play Mission Sherilyn in the Class 5A boys state semifinals at 4 p.m. Mountain Time Thursday. The Highlanders are trying to win a state title for the second time in four years and polish off an undefeated season. Full coverage for you tomorrow from Georgetown on KTSF.